i what is the value of x given that you have 4 to the power of x equals 100 then let's have it to be solution from here let's introduce log to both sides so from here will be log 4 to the power of x equals log 100 then recall that when we have log p to the power of m the power m we come down to base to be m multiplied by log p so from here we have x multiplied by log 4 equals log 100 then let's divide through by log 4 in order to get the possible value of x so this we cancel out this so we have x to be equals log 100 divided by log 4 but let us recall that we can have 100 to be equals 25 times 4 so from here this implies we are going to have x to be equals log 25 times 4 divided by log 4 then let us recall that when we have log a times b from the law of logarithm equals log a plus log b so when we apply it here we have x to be equals log 25 plus log 4 divided by log 4 once again recall that when we have a plus b divided by c such that a and b are constants this can be simplified as a divided by c plus b divided by c so from here we have x to be log 25 divided by log 4 plus log 4 divided by log divided by log 4 so from here we have x log 4 divided by log 4 will be 1 plus log 25 divided by log 4 then once again we can have 25 as the product of 5 times 5 which equals 5 to the power of 2 and we can have 4 as the product of 2 times 2 which equals 2 to the power of 2 so when we substitute it here we have x to be 1 plus log 5 to the power of 2 plus log 2 to the power of 2 so recall that when we have log 1 plus the, this power 2 we come down to base to 2 multiplied by log 5 divided by 2 multiplied by log 2 and so therefore we have x 1 plus this we cancel out this log 5 divided by log 2 when we have log a divided by log b we can simplify this to be log a in base b so therefore from here we have x to be 1 plus log 5 in base 2 so this is the value of x now let us check so from here let's add a shortcut when we introduce log we have it to be log 4 to the power of x equals log 100 this power will come down to base to be log x multiplied by log 
4 equals log 100. So from here, let's divide 2 by log 4. This and this will cancel out. We have x to be log 100 divided by log 4. And we can simplify this as x will be equals log 100 in this 4. Mind you that this is also equals as 1 plus log 5 in this 2. They are the same. So let us now verify. We have 4 to the power of s equals 100. So from here, when we have for the first one here, we have 4 to the power of 1 plus log 5 in base 2. Then it's going to give us 100. When we have a to the power of n plus n equals as a to the power of n multiplied by a to the power of n. So this will be 4 to the power of 1 multiplied by 4 to the power of log 5 from base 2. Then it's going to give us 100. 4 to the power of 1 will give us 4 multiplied by 4 to the power of log 5 in base 2. Then it's going to give us 100. So when we have 4 equals as 2 times 2, which equals 2 to the power of 2. So from here, we can have it as 4 times 2 to the power of 2 to the power of log 5 in base 2 is going to give us 100. So from here, we have 4 multiplied by 2 to the power of log 2 multiplied by log 5 in base 2. Then it's going to give us 100. When we have a multiplied by log a in base b equals as log a to the power of n in base b. So therefore, 2 multiplied by log 5 in base 2 equals as log 5 to the power of 2 in base 2. So from here we have 4 multiplied by log multiplied by 2 to the power of log 5 to the power of 2 is 25 in base 2. Then it's going to give us 100. They have the same base. So you can equate the power to be 4 times the output will be 25, which equals 100. From here, 100 equals 100. So if you want to verify for the second one, for this one, it is very simple. Recall that we have 4 to the power of s equals 100 and s equals log 100 in base 4. So this will be 4 to the power of log 100 in base 4. Then it's going to give us 100. So far this and this are the same because when you have a to the power of log b in base a, a and a is here. The output will be b. So therefore, 100 will be equals 100. So this satisfied. Bye-bye.